Hey guys, how's it going? This is David Shea with Active IT Solutions. We specialize in outsourced IT maintenance and tech solutions with a focus on small and medium sized businesses. And today I want to show you how to change your logo in Google Apps. So if you're new to Google Apps, you may still have the Google or Gmail logo up at the top left corner here. Or maybe you've had an old logo that somebody put on for a while and you want to update it. And that just so happens to be our case. I actually changed our logo and rebranded about a year ago, and I've just been lazy and I haven't gotten around to changing this. So today we're going to jump right in and show you how to make this guy right here better, different, awesome, etc. So here we go. The first thing you got to do is make sure that you're in an administrative account. If you are a normal user, sorry, but you can't do this. You got to go grab an administrator and you have to be in their profile. So make sure you're an administrator. All right, so that's step one. Next, once you've signed in as an administrator, you're gonna go up to the top right here to settings. It's this little gear sprocket guy right here. And we're gonna go to manage this domain. Now under manage this domain, this is kind of the control center for admins. This is where you can add users, delete users, you can handle billing, you can enable and disable apps, security, etc. But today we're going to go into company profile. Under company profile, we're then, we'll then go into personalization. And you will notice here, I got the old Google logo here, and I got my old Active IT logo. Um, so this is what I'm going to change, but some of you may still be checked on the Google. So if you are on your default logo, go ahead and select custom logo and we're going to go ahead and choose the logo that we want to upload by clicking on choose file. Once you've found the logo that you want, go ahead and click open and then upload. So one thing you got to make sure about with your uh, logo, you may get a little red error at the bottom here if it doesn't upload that says the maximum file size is 30 kilobytes. It says right here that your PNG or GIF needs to be 320 by 132 pixels and no bigger than 30 kilobytes in size. Otherwise it'll go eh, sorry. Once you do that then go ahead and um, let's see what does this say? Show this logo on all sites the user creates. Sure. Let's go ahead and check that. And then we're gonna say save and you're done. So now all we have to do is uh, go over here and if it hasn't shown up already like mine did you can hit refresh and you should be good to go. So I'll tell you one other quick little thing. Um, in Photoshop if that's what you're using to kind of work with your logo or if you have a graphic designer if they send it in a PNG format with no official background I'll, I'll kind of show you what that looks like. Um, in this background, you'll notice that it's all white versus um, this. You see how there's like this checkered kind of look? This means that there isn't really a background. So when I export this as a PNG, what's going to happen is, is that any other kind of background that you have, for example, my awesome picture of mountaineers climbing this mountain, um, it's not going to have a white box here. Like if you look at the beginning video, you'll notice that my old logo had this white box where this it just looks a little bit more slick and a little nicer when I go to print something out like if I go here and I I tell this to print it's still going to you know show my logo with white and, and it's gonna look all nice and formatted um, so yeah that's just kind of a, a tip you know make sure you don't have a background and export it as a PNG and make sure that the file size is less than 30 kilobytes if you need help with that you can always hit me up send me a message PM me um, you know, you contact us on our website and we can discuss, um, you know, me formatting your uh, logo to look like this. So I wish you guys the best of luck. Thank you so much for watching this. Um, if this was helpful, go ahead and like or share. And if you got any questions, comment below. Have a nice day.